So yesterday I made a video basically talking about how 343 was in a lot of trouble. They've been going through a bunch of massive layoffs and that really just the future of Halo has been just extremely uncertain. And well, uh, as I was sitting on the couch, I was just looking at some of the news and something popped up in my feed. And this one is kind of big. Um, so basically, it's looking like 343 may possibly be done leading development on new Halo games. Yeah, let that sink in. So 343 has basically just, it's been a bombshell. Um, this being completely honest, Infinite was a complete disaster. Halo 5 had, sure, Halo 5 had a lot of problems. At the very least, it was not Infinite. Um, Halo 4, people were split on. I personally actually liked Halo 4. I thought it was fine. I don't really know if it's unexpected. Either way, it's big. So 343 Industries is reportedly being removed from active development of the Halo franchise as part of the ongoing layoffs across Microsoft. Halo Infinite, despite initial success, has not seen a long-term support from Halo fans that Xbox Game Studios was hoping for. Not only did the live service support, not only did a lot live service support at launch feel thin and aggressively monetized, which it was, the store prices was absolutely god awful and was a complete nightmare, but updates to Halo Infinite since haven't proven to have a compelling reason to give it a new try. Now, perhaps 343 Industries won't be getting another opportunity. So it's looking like this may possibly be real. It's it's slowly more and more news is coming out about it. It's coming from a couple different sources. Now, the original source to all of this is coming from GameSpot, um, stating that 343 Industries will no longer be making Halo games, but will oversee outside development. Basically, this is coming off of a known Halo leaker named Bathrobe Spartan, who has a solid track regarding Halo inside information. This is all being translated as they are not an English-speaking account. Uh, Microsoft's mass layoffs have hit 343 Industries hard and will see up to a third of his workforce laid, laid off. So, um, veteran developer Joseph Satis reportedly is now exiting the studio and will rejoin Xbox Publishing. What would happen would be that 3-4 Industries would now become just a parental role for Halo. It's just going to be a name. It's, if you remember, I think a good example would be, would be Dark Souls 2. So Dark Souls 2 was completely in development by an entirely different team, an entirely different studio handled Dark Souls 2. From Software was the parental company involved in Dark Souls 2. They were just there to pretty much go, oh yeah, this kind of, this fits the world of Dark Souls, and they just went with it. That would initially be what is would happen to 343 if this is all true. I don't even know what to really say, man. Um, basically, the rest of the article goes into just how much of a nightmare Infinite has been, talking about how, you know, Season 3 is coming up, uh, it's still scheduled to happen, by the way. Season 3 is still going to happen. Um, Season 3 Echoes Within is still scheduled to launch on March 7th and will add new multiplayer maps, the Bandit Rifle, and two new game modes. I really don't know how to really make of this. I'm going to be completely honest here, and I'm just going to be giving my initial take on things. I think this is really just for the best. Um, for the longest time in the Halo community, it has been an absolute outcry of just pure anger Every Halo title has had just massive backlash, and I think this people are sick of it, man. Halo Infinite was such a just complete disaster to the point that 343 completely dead at this point. And if they were to make a standoff point where they were just to be a, a parental company, basically attach their name to it and to just kind of be there to somewhat help out the Halo scene is about all it's looking like it might end up being. I don't know what might happen, Halo is still in a very weird spot. Now, there has not been, to answer your questions, there has not been an update on who would handle Halo afterwards. That is all still completely unclear. If anything, still maybe take this with a grain of salt. Um, there's also people who are also saying that maybe, per possibly, certain affinity could be handling this. It's, I don't know. But, like I said, I would take this possibly with a grain of salt. We don't know if this is all entirely true. It's just that this is coming from some insider reports and from some from a known Halo leaker in the industry. 
Um, this news is just slowly starting to make it up. Uh, GameSpot made a post on this, and it's also coming from Game Rant now. Uh, they just recently put it up. This is brand new news. It just happened. Like This is just starting to circulating two hours ago. So uh, we'll see how this all unfolds. Either way, how do you guys feel? Do you think that 343 should a fresh management kind of reboot the dev team and see what happens with them as they move forward? Do you think we should keep pushing infinite? Do you think infinite is just it's time to give up on it? Or do you think that uh, 343 needs to be out? It's a good thing. Can't wait to see what the next company is, etc., etc. Either way, Spartans, I'm interested to hear your takes. Let me have them. This is uh, an interesting situation we're in, guys. I, I don't really know. Stay up in the battlefield, Spartans, and uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Away!